Hello again, Doran Markowitz here from D Guitars Miami with another edition of This Week in Cool Custom Crafted Guitars. This week's particular instrument is another of my Golden Lion models that I just finished building for a client by the name of Gregory Ram. Um, he wanted something that really would stand out and have some gorgeous woods to it. And so what I did was I basically made this uh, with a neck that's five pieces of maple, walnut, maple. The body consists of eight pieces of wood all together. The top is three pieces of eighth inch purple heart and red oak. And the rest of the body, the whole body is about one and eleven sixteenth inch thick. The rest of the body is five pieces of wood. You have butternut and purple and uh, poplar right in the middle. Control plate is also purple heart. The truss rod cover which is engraved with his name is also purple heart. And on the back you can see the uh, company information, uh, the model number which is the GL-GO2. That second G is for Gregory. And the completion date, my signature, etc. This thing really, really is a fantastic guitar and it only weighs about six and a half pounds. Okay? Um, I loaded it with a pair of GFS Fat Pat humbuckers at the neck and bridge and a Dan Electro single coil lipstick in the middle. The way I wired it was master volume of 500k, 250k volume, uh, uh, tone, and then these two switches here are coil tap switches for the neck and bridge respectively, but they're more coil selection than coil tapping. Um, they're three position. This one operates the bridge, this one operates the neck, and this switch is a, um, a neck bypass switch so that when you put it on the neck can join the bridge pickup. Um, basically how it works, I'll give you a quick example. The bridge pickup, for instance, full humbucking. If I put the switch down, it gives me just this coil. If I put it up, it gives you this coil. Same thing with the neck pickup, full humbucking. Now we have this coil closest to the bridge. And now we have the neckmost coil. And I topped it with a pair of nice uh, Babinga wood knobs. The bridge is the Stets bar, which I've raved about numerous times, and especially in the video of my last Golden Lion. And at the headstock we have a set of Proline locking tuners, which are self-locking, uh, very easy to use, just like on my other Golden Lion and a uh, bone nut. It's strung with tens. It's, uh, it's got a really nice smaller C shape. You wanted something smaller and comfortable. All right, let's get to some of the tone qualities of this guitar. There's the bridge pickup. It's a very fast neck. And you already heard the bridge uh, coil tapped. I'm going to put this pickup coil with the middle pickup. Now let's put this full humbucking again with the middle pickup. put just the middle pickup on, there's that that glassy spank that you're used to hearing from a Dan Electro. What's cool is that it's got an almost acoustic quality to it, a lot of shimmer. A lot of sparkle. Alright, so now middle and uh, neck position, full humbucking. Alright, let's coil tap it. Neck most coil with the middle pickup. And 
again, the Stets bar is so light action, you can literally whammy with your pinky. It comes back in tune every time. And the neck pick up by itself. And the intonation is perfect all the way. The way I have it wired also, it's got a .033 cap instead of a .02. And I have it wired vintage 50 style, meaning that the uh, tone control is actually wired to the output of the volume pot, not the input, which makes a big difference. It's got a more even sweep to it. And especially if you're rolling off the volume. Kind of like having that treble bleed circuit. You don't lose any of the highs. I'm going to turn up the amp a little so that you can hear it more clearly. It's a 24 fret neck, 25 and a half inch scale. So it's got a nice length of a fender. But it's got Gibson style tones as well. It's very, very versatile. I mean, you can get everything from single coil to home bucking. You can get Strat type tones. You can get Les Paul type tones. It's, it's great. All right, let's put some distortion on and see how it cooks. I'm going to put on some basic overdrive distortion. to the bridge. And just for the hell of it, put the middle on as well. We have all three on. Nice and warm. into the middle. Is that you 
you can actually hear with all that overlaid distortion on there, you can still hear so much clarity and articulation of the notes. Um, I can't say enough about this guitar. It's got such great resonance to it. It's got a great acoustic resonance too. It's very lively. Which, of course, translates to the amplified tone. It's very, it's very sparkly, very resonant. these two together you get kind of a different cool uh, combination say enough about this guitar I'm actually I'm really really proud of the uh, the job that I did on this um, I take a lot of pride in my work but this one is really really special because this is the second golden line that I've built and it's the first one for a client and uh, it really made it really made me feel good when he came by to ask me to build him a guitar and saw the one that I built myself and said yeah that's the style I'd like so anyway that's enough out of me um, I could go on and on and show more of what this guitar does, but I think you get the idea. And so, if you would like to have uh, an instrument built like your own Golden Lion model or some other model that you've got in mind, or if you have some repairs that need to be done, such as a broken headstock repaired, fret work, electronics, finish work, whatever, don't hesitate to give me a call at 305-896-1811. Until next time, Dorn Markowitz. From D Guitars Miami, thanks for watching and have a great day.